saying there was two snipers, elevated positions. And does your brother have any sort of skill to do this? No, we were all on the ground. Listen, listen, my brother was marching with us. Yeah. And so because he's my brother and I understood, I understood the severity of the situation, my first instinct was to tell him, get that gun away. The fire was coming from where, in, a, in a different location. But I knew, I knew because he had his firearm that someone, a cop could misidentify him or something like that. So I made sure he gave his gun to a cop. Corey, do you know, do you know where, he, where he went? He was on his way home. He was on his way home. He was on his way home. So now you're not telling the police and doing everything that you I'm, I'm telling the police. I'm telling the country. Whoever, and the, the police are sort of pulling you away right now. Whoever, whoever has put this, this picture out as my brother's a suspect, Mark Hughes is not a suspect. His gun was not loaded. And when the fires, when the shots started firing, he gave his gun to a law enforcement. So we're going to ask you this. Why did you bring a gun to a peaceful home? The same reason that across the country that other people bring their gun because it is his right. And he was just simply exercising his right. And he never thought by exercising his right, he would be plastered all over the national media as a suspect.